Day Preschool. So our story this week, Little Red Riding Hood, is all about a girl called Little Red Riding Hood and she goes to visit her granny who lives in the woods. And her granny lives in a cottage. Now whilst I was having a look through my books, I found another Little Red Riding Hood book. So it's different from the one that I read. And in this one, if I open it up to this page, unfortunately, there's the wolf. Now here, this is Granny's cottage. So if you have a look, Granny in this story lives in a cottage. And a cottage is a type of home. Now some cottages are very special because they have a thatched roof, which is a roof that's made from straw. So what I'd like you to do as one of your challenges today is think about lots of different houses. I'm going to show you some photographs of some houses, tell you a little bit about it, and then I'll explain what I'd like you to do. The first house we're going to look at is a detached house, which means it doesn't have any other house joining onto it. Next is a semi-detached house. That means it's two houses joined together. The next house is a bungalow. A bungalow is a house on one level. It doesn't have any stairs. And here are some cottages. Now this is just like the house Granny lived in, in the story Little Red Riding Hood. And as you can see, it's got a very special roof. It's called a thatched roof and it's made from straw. Here we have some flats. Now flats are lots of different homes, all on different levels, all on different floors. Now some flats have got lots and lots of floors and some flats have only got two or three floors. So there you go, preschool. There's some examples of different types of houses that people might live in. So your challenge is to have a look around where you live. Look at the houses nearby and have a think. Are they detached? Are they semi-detached? Are there flats or bungalows? So when you're out with your grown-up, I want you to look really carefully at all the houses and then I want you to let us know what sort of houses you have got near to where you live. Have fun!